Hello, good morning. Um, in this uh, uh, session, we try to see how to invest in stocks. Okay, the best way to invest in stocks is to do like mutual funds. Okay, so what does the mutual funds do? is they buy a lot of stocks like 10 stocks or 20 or more some they they buy a lot like 50 or 100 now when you buy these stocks you buy them and then you will wait this is one one thing buy first thing you do is buy second is you wait now since you invest it means that you know the company that you are investing in what does it mean it means you are not doing trading you are investing you are putting money to this stock because of the company okay because of the company so you do your research about these companies now when you find one or two or three or ten or twenty whatever you like and these companies are in your opinion are very good usually uh, companies that are like that are good the most important thing is earnings Is the earnings going up? For example, if a company um, this year has, for example, one billion dollars, like earnings, next year you should see one billion, for example, two hundred million. Next year, one hundred five five million. Okay, so it means that the earnings. The earnings of the company is going up. That's why you like this company. That's why you buy it. Okay? If the, if the company earnings is going down, there is no need to buy it because it is losing money. Now, uh, so you buy the company for its earnings or products or something like that. Earnings is very important. A. Now, B. It has less debt okay a company that that has a lot of debt the debt will be a burden most of the time is a burden and it stops the company from going that that fast okay so this is in general so you buy 10 stocks for example or 20 or 30 uh, depending on how much money you have so each company, in order to follow the company, each like each earnings or like from uh, we we see here the time. When you invest, it means you invest for a long time. Generally, people when they invest, they invest for years. Okay, a couple of years. It's not a day to day. Uh, trading okay you don't trade you invest investing it means you know a lot of things about the company it has good earnings it is less it has less debt and you need time this is the most important things you need time it's not in one day or ten days or one month or two that you can get a big profit you, you can't do that this is trading now, in order to invest, you should need years, okay? Now, number three, those companies that you bought before, if you see that one company or two is doing bad, doing bad, it means, for example, if you buy a stock with $20, 
and you see it's going to 15 this is a dangerous thing it means the company is losing money or the company or the uh, stock is losing money and you should have in your in your um, a plan you should have uh, what we call a uh, stop loss okay so whenever you buy stocks not all they go bad few they go up few they and others they go down so you you are see, you are looking at the majority of the stocks that you own that's why the mutual fund do okay the mutual uh, mutual fund do is diversification four is diversification diversification so what does it mean diversification it means you don't buy the same stocks in the same sector or industry okay you should change for example I'll give you an example about this um, for example if if you are If you are investing in banks, stocks, you should, for example, go to retail stocks, retail, or you go to pharmacy stocks, or you go to um, uh, like uh, oil stocks. It means you should you should diversify because <coughs> some stocks in the banks, for example, they are going up. You find that, for example, retail going down, this pharmacy going down, maybe the oil is going up. So this is how the mutual fund uh, works. It means they see the whole market. Some are going up, some going down. So you lose a little bit, but by time, by time, your invest will make more money. Another thing, uh, some. There are two ways for investing. Some they use only growth stocks, and some they use what we call dividend stock. Okay. Now, growth stocks, the majority of the growth stocks, they don't give dividend. No dividend. So they give no dividend or, or just little dividend and these growth stocks most of the time they go fast okay they go fast dividend stocks because they give a dividend they give you uh, uh, some money from their earnings this is a dividend they give you some money as a dividend so the stocks doesn't go that high so it goes like this it is going up, it's good, but most of the time, this dividend stock, they go just, for example, in one year, they can have one dollar or five dollars a year, for example, like a profit. But growth stocks, these stocks, they go very, very fast. They can go from six dollars to ninety. Okay? Like some, some pharmacy stocks, they are really, really like, uh, fast. So you can make uh, a lot of money. So this is in general how to invest in stocks. Now, in order to search, you should search for these stocks. Search. So searching needs time. It means you have stock screener and you search for the stocks that you want to buy. For example, you, you are interested to buy a certain price. For example, you buy only from 10 to $15 a stock, 10 or from 10 to 15. Because those stocks that are uh, very small stocks, they can go higher and higher than a stock with two hundred dollars, and especially if you don't have money to buy these big stocks, two hundred, two hundred dollars. Although they are good companies, 
you can buy from 10 to 15 because my, maybe this 10 it goes to 20 in a year or two so you make profit by it. this is in general uh, what do you mean by to invest in uh, in stocks it means you are not just investing in these stocks but you are investing in the companies it means you should you should follow these companies follow them follow them okay and you don't sell them until you see that that uh, the loss is very big okay some people they stay 10% some 50% depends depends on the people how they do each one has has his own uh, there is no uh, a stop loss that it is only one anyone has a choice to do whatever he wants okay because uh, to invest in investing the stock for example gain from 20 it can go to 40 and from 40 to 30 see this here okay from 20 it goes to 40 and 40 to 30 now if you are investing you shouldn't sell you, you will never sell until you see that that for example you begin you lose this from some 20 to 40 it's 20 dollars per share and then you lose 10 now you should wait until you see that um, that the company is losing money the company itself it means earnings the earnings going down 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 that means that the company is having some problem now when it is having some problem you should get out from this company and buy another one that it is healthier than the other one okay so this is this is the thing now if you are trading it's different if you buy from 20 it goes to 40 and it goes it goes just 38 or 39 or or, uh, or uh, 36 you get out from this because you need you need this money that you gain okay the profit you gain you need you don't want to stay with the company the whole life you you are just trading but investing is is like this so let's let's see an example you begin from 20 you invest it goes to 40 it goes to 30 then it goes to 50 it goes to 46 and then it goes to 70 this is what we call investing so in this uh, correction of the market here you should wait you should wait and don't sell until until you see that there is no there is a problem with the company okay so that's why you are investing you are not doing like day trading or uh, swing trading or um, the other position trading you are just following the, the company because it's a good company and you are convinced that the stock will go up because it's a good company maybe the mutual fund buy it this is in general about uh, investing some people they invest for the whole life they buy for example 10 20 30 and they just buy 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 and leave now some they do great so few they don't do great this is what we call investing there is no what we call in trading or investing there is no a sure thing there is no a sure thing the sure thing is that the market changes this is the sure thing but you don't know if it goes up or down depends on the market depends on the people who are in the market uh, this is all for uh, how to invest in stocks. If you have question or something, just uh, let me know or comment. Thank you very much.